Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Gopinath Krishnraj. In MATLAB programming level 8, we will discuss about string manipulation in MATLAB programming. In this topic, we will discuss about creating string variables, how the strings uh, work, work as a vector. Second one is the operations on strings, which includes concatenation, creating customized string, removing white space character, comparing strings, and finding, replacing, and separating strings. First, we will discuss about what is meant by string. A string in the MATLAB, uh, which consists of any number of characters and is contained in a single quotes. Actually, strings are treated as a vectors in which every element in a single character, which means that many of the vector operations and functions that we have uh, seen already, how the strings are working. That same way, MATLAB also has some many built-in functions that are written specifically to manipulate strings. In some cases, string contains numbers and it is useful to convert from strings to numbers like twice. MATLAB has uh, many functions. There are many applications for using strings even uh, in, in field that are predominantly numerical. For example, when data file consists of uh, combinations of numbers and characters, it is often necessary to read uh, each line from the uh, file as a string, uh, break the string into pieces, uh, and uh, convert the parts that contain a numbers to number variables that can be used to computations. Uh, in this uh, topic, we will discuss about string manipulations, how the uh, strings are manipulated. First, we will discuss about creating string variables. A string consists of any number of characters. Uh, here the example uh, empty string um, cx cat hello there which is enclosed uh, enclosed by single quotation a substring is a subset or part of a string for example here uh, there is a substring within the string hello there characters include letters of the alphabet a digit punctuation marks white space and control characters here control characters are a character that cannot be printed but accomplish the task and the control character example means the backspace or tab which is accomplish the task next white space character include the space tab new line uh, which move which is moves the cursor down to the next line and the carriage return uh, which moves the cursor, uh, cursor to the beginning of the current line uh, leading blanks uh, which is a blank space at the beginning of a string for example, here is the example, uh, we are uh, having uh, empty space, afterwards we will start with hello. Here, uh, this example considered as leading space, trailing space blanks uh, or a blank space at the end of a string. There are several ways that the string variables can be created. One is uh, using assignment operator. Here the example word equal cat. This is the first step. Another method is, uh, is to read into a string variable. Recall that read into a string variable using the input function. Uh, the second arguments must be included. Here the example string variable. Uh, we will get the uh, value from by using input operations. The string name is x, y, z, a, b, c. The string where there is str, v, a, r is a string variable name which is uh, uh, accommodated x, y, z, a, b, c. That is a variable name. Next, we will discuss about a subtopic of uh, creating string variable as uh, strings as vectors. Strings are, uh, are treated as vector of characters, uh, a vector in which every element in a single character uh, in many vector operations can be performed. For example, the number of characters in a string can be found using the length of function. Here the example, uh, we will have find out the length, length values cat empty string and then non empty string here here the empty string which uh, empty string will be declared as a value 1 uh, cat will be declared as 3 non empty string will be declared as 0 this is the answer notice that there is a difference between an empty string which has a length of 0 and a string consists of a blank space uh, which has a length of 1 next we will discuss about uh, operations on strings MATLAB has many built-in functions that work with strings. Some of the string manipulation functions that perform the most common operations will be described here. First one is the concatenation. Um, string concatenation means to join strings together. Of course, 
Since strings are just a vectors of characters, the method of concatenating vectors works for the strings. For example, to create one long string from two strings, it is possible to join them by putting them in a square brackets. Here, the example, uh, the variable first has a bird, the last has house. Uh, we are concatenating by using the square bracket. First, uh, uh, first space last, the answer will be displayed, uh, displayed as bird house. The function strcat that is a string concatenation does this uh, also horizontally, meaning that e, e, that it create one longer string from inputs. And uh, the, here the example two will be declared. There is a difference between um, these two methods of concatenating. However, if the leading or trailing blanks in the strings the method of using the square bracket will concatenate uh, the strings include all leading and trailing blanks here the example string one triple x space here the example sorry string two space triple y we are concatenating by using the square bracket the answer will be displayed the length of the value is 12 this is the next step of concatenating next topic uh, is creating customized strings there are several built-in functions that uh, create customized strings include car blanks and s printf uh, we, we have seen already that the car function can be used to convert the ascii code to a character for example car 97 uh, the 97 is equivalent to alphabet a the car function can also be used to create matrix of characters uh, when using the car function to create a matrix it will automatically add the string within the row with blanks as necessary so they so that they are uh, all the same length uh, just like uh, str v c a t this is the function he, uh, here uh, greet mat is the variable name we are using hello goodbye this is the two inputs are giving uh, this is uh, displayed as a matrix the size of the matrix will be 27 that is a value will be declared 27 next the blank function will create a string consist of uh, n blank characters which are kind of hot in matlab the mouse is moved highlight in the result uh, answer the blank can be seen blanks four uh, and the length of answer will be displayed as four next topic is removing white space characters in operations on strings the third part is removing white space characters matlab has functions that will remove trailing blanks from the end of the string or uh, leading blanks from the beginning of a string uh, the de that is a de blank function will remove blank space from end of the string for example if uh, some string are padded in a string matrix so that uh, that are all are the same length it is frequently preferred to the remove those extra blank spaces order to actually use the string uh, here uh, the names is a variable name uh, sue kathy savior these are the three names will be added uh, these are all the example uh, we'll discuss about uh, name will be displayed uh, we are using length means length will be displayed uh, d blank d blank will, will be declared as uh, removing the white space characters like face next topic is a uh, comparing a string uh, there are several functions that compare strings and return logical true if they are equivalent or logical false if not the functions str cmp that is a string string compare compare the strings character by character it returns a logical true if the strings are completely identical or logical false if the strings are uh, not the same length or any corresponding characters uh, are not identical here the sum of examples will be comparing first one is word one uh, hold a cat second word two has a car word three cathedral word four will be alphabet car we are going to be compare word one word two automatically it's not uh, matching so our answer will be displayed as zero the next one word one word three this is also it's not equal automatically the value will be zero but word one word one is comparing automatically the word one as a cat second one word one as a cat the automatically string one sorry value one will be displayed this is a uh, 
true value that's one will be displayed second word two and word four it's also not uh, equivalent so the automatically zero will be displayed last one uh, finding replacing and separating strings there are several functions that to that find and replace strings or parts of a strings uh, within other strings and uh, functions that separate strings into substrings the functions a uh, find str that is find string receives two two strings as a input arguments it finds all the occurrences of the shorter string within the longer and returns the subscript of the beginning of occurrences the order of the string does not matter with find str it will always find the shorter string with, within the longer whichever that is uh, the so shorter string can consist of one character or any number of characters if there is more than one occurrences of the shorter string uh, within the longer one if find str returns a vector uh, with all indicators note that uh, what returned is the index of a beginning of a shorter string this is the example here uh, find str a b c d e uh, this is the position of d is 4 that same way uh, second example also we'll finding the d position also it is a 4 the b c uh, automatically it, it took a value uh, as b b position b position will be 2 uh, afterwards d where uh, 4 9 11 12 uh, these are all the position in that particular string as 4 9 11 12 in this fourth example thank you guys Uh, thank you for watching this uh, video please subscribe my channel uh, li like my channel and share and comment it thank you guys